When I see an injured animal, the first thing I think is, what can I do to help that animal? How do they get cured? And I did some investigation and found the Florida Wildlife Hospital and Sanctuary was exactly what I was looking for. My name is Mick Karalik. I'm a volunteer at the Florida Wildlife Hospital and Sanctuary. I've been volunteering here for about 12 years now. We take in injured, distressed animals of all types, and I could help the animals and help the community. A couple weeks after Hurricane Irma, we had over 350 patients admitted to the hospital. We call them patients, they're animals, but they're still patients to us. A lot of these were baby squirrels. I think 190 baby squirrels came in. A lot of them, they're just stressed or they're scared. Others needed a lot more care. We had birds come in that had a bad wing. Without a place like the Florida Wildlife Hospital, probably the majority of those would have just perished. Certain animals come in that cannot ever be released again. We've got a barn owl, Corey, a beautiful bird, loving and friendly, missing half a wing. We kept him as an ambassador owl, and we use him to educate school children. So that's one of the ways we can introduce these animals that are typically in the wild that you cannot get close to. Being a Cost Conserve Heroes finalist was quite a surprise to me. I'm doing this for the love of the animals, to help where I can, to give back to the communities. We receive no government funding at all. So, you know, we're relying on the community to help us help the animals. The creatures that we get in are from the wild. We bring them through here, do what it takes to get them to return to the wild, back where they belong. They belong in Mother Nature, they are part of Mother Nature, and uh, that's what we do. Thank you.